Hello, today I'm attempting step duel, which is uh, a wordle variant where you have to solve four consecutive wordles. First, a four letter word, as you can see on the screen, and then a five letter word, a six letter word, and a seven letter word. What are we going to try for this? Let's just move the A and see what happens. Well, good news and bad news. We've got the A in the right place. Bad news is we've ruled out lots of other things. Okay, let's maybe try another vow. Ooh. Oh, it's not land either. So what can it be? Lord? Not the most common of words. Would have been amusing if you started with jewel, D-U-A-L, <laughs> and just found out that it was the correct word backwards. Um, let's move on to the fives then. Let's do shine. We shouldn't have bothered, although ruling out the E early days might help. I was about to say I'm not going to panic, but I'm not going to type in panic because we've ruled out the N. So what am I going to type in? How about diary? Can't be dairy, of course. And so we do have the I in the right position. Although it might be something like livid with a double I. I'm gonna. Oh, I was gonna. Uh, I'm gonna try limbo first to rule out some more letters. But I, I'm gonna pretend I'm on hard mode, and I'm gonna force myself to use the D. And the only thing I can think of at the moment that uses the D is livid. So let's try that and see what happens. Ah, uh -huh, okay. So it is a double I, but it's not livid. So what can it be? Timid, he whispered, but it was correct. Um, what shall we try as the first guess on the six letter word? Let's try search, it uses a few common letters and we've ruled them all out, so that's useful. Uh, try bounty then, which uses completely different letters. Okay, so we've got the ending. So is it going to be uh, blank U blank I T1? I can only think of unity, that's, that's the sort of word style I'm thinking of, but obviously that's not long enough and we can't have the N. Um, and it, uh, but most other words that I can think of for things like mutiny, but then the T would be in the wrong place. Um, let's try upper T, because at least then we'll know if the U and the I combo is correct. Or when it is, but the I isn't there. Okay, so if the I is not there, that makes me think the I could be there and the T could be there because it can't be something like equity, because that's the U before the I, and with, we want them the other way around. Um, the I could be first, of course. IM is a common starting word, a sequence, but immuti I don't think is a word. Um, if the U is second, the U is second, I'm guilty of overlooking that possibility. It's a common word, a lot more common than upper T probably, <laughs> I probably should have tried to guess that earlier. Um, right, and now we're on to the seven letter word and we've got seven guesses in hand, so we should be able to do this what would be a good starting word. Uh, let's try scorned. I'm really good at using the wrong vowels in my first guess today. So we want to use the A, the I, the A, U perhaps, maybe a Y. Um, maybe a 
ISH ending or an IST. There are so many options. But even thinking of one word that, that works, I'm not used to thinking of seven letter words. Oh, it could be an ING ending. Let's go for mashing. It's not an ING ending. And we've ruled out the I, so very few different vowels used. We're not making much progress here, are we? We don't know the correct positions of anything yet. Um, N probably is not going to be the end because it doesn't end M A N, like postman or something like that. I suppose the end still could be at the end, of course. Who knows? Hmm. easy this one and of course the S not being first makes it a bit tricky as well I want to try a word starting with UN but I cannot think of one that fits Most UN words, it feels like they use an E, although I suppose it could be unusual. I don't think this is a very good guess, because if it's not something with a lot of U's, we're going to waste all of our guesses. But I'm going to go for this one, because it's the first valid word I thought of for a while. And it's correct. Wow, very unusual sequence of letters. And bizarrely, I've got the seven quicker than I got the others. I think four is the most difficult one, because if you don't get close on your first guess or two, there are just so many possibilities. Um, but I'm very happy to get the seven letter one in just the third guess. So that's step dog for today. Let me know how you got on. Let me know if you enjoyed this and uh, like the video. Um, thank you for watching, bye for today.